In this video, we'll create a computer group. Computer groups allow you to define a set of endpoints to use within different Tanium functions. Tanium comes out of the box with several different computer groups, such as ones for operating systems, as you can see here. You can use computer groups for things like restricting user access or for targeting with actions, patch deployments, or comply assessments. In this example, I'll need to create a group of systems that I'll be using for testing. To get to the Create Computer Group page, I'll need to click New Computer Group at the top right. Here you can enter in a few details. You can give the computer group a name to help easily recognize it. In the Additional Options section, you can make the computer group available for filtering, such as when viewing question results or reporting data. I'll click Enable so we can see an example later. You're also asked to specify a content set, so you can use role-based access control, or RBAC, to limit who has access to the filter group. I'll use the default filter group's content set, which everyone should have access to. At the bottom section, you can define which endpoints are going to be members of your computer group. There are three different options to choose from. The first option is the filter bar. With the filter bar, you can use plain English and get recommendations on what to use. For example, when I type virtual contains no, I'll get a list of available options. Once I click the suggested option, it'll show me a preview of the results at the bottom. The second option is the filter builder. The filter builder is great for when you have multiple filters or when you need to use complex criteria to define group membership. Here I can add multiple rows, such as domain name, and the is virtual sensor. The final option is manual group. Here you can provide a static list of computer names to define membership. The computer names should be separated by new lines or by commas. You'll want to ensure that the computer names match the results of the computer name sensor. We recommend using the manual group option as a last resort, as the filter options will give you dynamic membership, allowing for more flexibility should your environment change in the future. In this example, all of my test systems have a specific custom tag. I'll use the filter bar and the custom tag sensor to define group membership. I'll type custom tags equals test group, which is the name of my custom tag. Once I click the suggestion, I can once again preview the results at the bottom to ensure I'm getting the right computers. Once everything looks correct, I can click save at the bottom, then confirm. This will create my computer group. On the computer groups page, I can use the filter bar to search for my new test group. To show how the enable filter option works, I'll ask get installed applications from all machines. On the question results page, I can use the filter by computer group dropdown to select my test group. This will now modify the results to only show me installed applications on my test group systems.